WFNN. Headline News Update. Hi, everyone. I know it's hard to believe, but uh, we've got the Dow down at the close today, early close at 1 o'clock Eastern Time. This is Basil Chapman, the host of the Tiger Technicians Hour. We just finished the show, noon to 1 p.m., and the author of the opening call. The Dow's down 35 at 28,515. Needs to go above 28,608 to make the next leg up. And the S&P's, oh, barely down. It is fractioning down, down 64 cents at 3223.37. It needs to go about 3227.78 uh, to start a new leg to the upside. We've got the QQQ, that's the NDX 100 trading vehicle. Uh, right now it is trading at uh, 211.99. It needs to go above 212. I think it was, oh, is that 200? There it is. 212.52 to start another leg to the upside, which I think it will. And the IWM, which actually went to a new recovery high today at 166.64, up 34 cents, is showing nice relative strength. Gold had a really strong session today. Gold is up $15 at 15.04. Uh, it really just smashed through that whole resistance in the 1292 area. This is good action. And the silver also went very sharply high. Silver is up 0.33. Remember yesterday, silver led the market, the gold uh, and the metals market higher. It's a 17.82 up 0.32. Um, that looks like the 18s. It's going to try for the 18s very quickly. And now you've also got, uh, I wanted to do the dollar. The dollar was down just a couple of pennies before. Now it's up a penny. 97.68. It is holding really well considering what the, the metals are doing. Crude oil. I didn't do crude oil in my show. I forgot, but crude oil is up. It should go higher to another leg to the upside. We're looking for that leg D in the Chapman Wave methodology above 61.40 in the continuous contract. The TLT also had an up day, up 37 cents at 136.82. Money will probably start to flow into the bonds if you start to get really sharp uh, moves to the downside in the market, and there's bad news to accompany with that. Meantime, back at the ranch, what we're looking at is markets holding near the all-time highs or at all-time highs, and let's see how it goes into the end of the week. Have a wonderful Christmas and a wonderful Hanukkah to everyone celebrating, and we will see you back here at TFNN on Thursday. Larry Pesaventa kicks us off right early on at 9 a.m. Have a wonderful uh, holiday. That's a